What's going on guys? It's your boy Ricky back with another video. Today is opening day all across the country in Major League Baseball. And as you guys know, or you may not know, if you've been following me on Instagram, you know, but I have started a position with Major League Baseball as a live content creator. I'm getting ready to head to the stadium. I'm going to be covering uh, player arrivals. I'm going to be taking photos uh, in the clubhouse, uh, player jerseys and stuff like that. All these things are content that's pushed out on Instagram, Facebook, all social media channels. So um, I don't know where my stuff will end up, but that's kind of how this whole situation works. So. Let's go ahead and go right to Tropicana Field. All right guys, so I'm here at Tropicana Field getting ready to get some images and video of batting practice. So guys, just go along with me as I do what I do, how I do it. So basically the pitcher just got done warming up. So I got several shots just showing emotion as he throws, showing just him warming up basically. So I'll get that. I'll push those right up to to, to the people at the top and they, they, they'll use them forever they want to use them for. So that's basically what I'm doing. I'm sorry for the audio because I forgot to bring my mic down here onto the field. But you guys get the gist of what I'm doing. And so today is Sunday. It's the last day of the series. It was a four game series between the Tampa Bay Rays and the Houston Astros. So what I've learned over the course of these four days is a lot. Um, it's a lot going on. It's a very exciting atmosphere. It's cool to be at the ballpark every day. But as far as the job goes, the, the title of the job is Live Content Creator. And what the people at MLB expect me to do is deliver content as close to real time as possible. Now, sometimes that's not always possible. However, they want you to get as close to that as possible. Sony has this thing, Play Memories, that allows me to press a button, which I made a custom button on my Sony A7R 3 I press that button, and what that button does is it allows me to select multiple images and send it straight to my iPhone. And then in turn, I send it straight up to MLB. What it forces me to do as a creator, as a photographer, is to get it right in camera. It's to be better in camera. Lightroom should only be bells and whistles. The image should come out of camera pretty, pretty good already. So that's one of the things that I know that I'm gonna get better at working this job that I've learned so far in these four days. And again, this job is cool, man. It's just being here, look, being in the ballpark and doing this type of job is it's great. And some of the players are starting to know who I am. So they're getting a little bit more comfortable around me with the camera because they know that I work here. So now they're kind of like giving me stuff, and posing and, or they'll, they, they won't pose, pose, but they'll like, they'll hold something that they're doing because they know I'm taking a photo and allow me to get the shot. So that also helps as well. So this is just some of the things that being a combat camera guy or being a military photographer prepared me for because this is a very stressful environment with everything going on and they expect you to deliver um, almost in real time. So the military prepared me for being able to get things done under tight deadlines and stressful situations. But again, guys, I just kind of wanted to end the video on this um, and let you guys know um, kind of how my experience is so far. I'll be bringing more content as time go along with baseball and I'll still continue to give you guys military content um, as that was the foundation of my channel. So um, again, guys, if this is your first time watching this video, make sure you like this video, make sure you subscribe to the channel and also make sure you hit the bell notification icon so you'll know when I post new content. Also, um, if you have any questions about being an MLB live content creator, put it down in the comments. If you're a baseball fan and you have a favorite team, I would like to know who that team is. So when I cover that team, you'll know and I'll be able to get some of your favorite players either on video or image of them. Send that, uh, comment that down below as well. Um, again, my name is Ricky Bowden and thanks for watching.